Well, it is views like this that signify the beginning of spring and the beginning of allergy season, something that impacts roughly one in four American adults. First solar meteorologist Spencer Blum is in studio now to break down a new report from Climate Central highlighting how allergy season is growing across much of the nation. Mm, Spencer. Hi, Peter. As the planet continues to warm, areas across the country are beginning to experience fewer freezes in the winter and a longer allergy season in the spring. A new report from Climate Central has found that since 1970, the freeze-free season has grown in more than 160 of the 197 cities analyzed by an average of 19 days. Because Palm Springs doesn't experience annual freezes, our freeze-free season lasts year-round, so we were not one of the cities analyzed. However, some cities have seen a huge increase in their freeze-free season. Reno, Nevada, for instance, has seen a whopping 95-day increase. This represents one of the largest increases around the nation. But how does climate change relate to a longer allergy season? Well, carbon pollutants help trap heat in the atmosphere and lead to warmer temperatures. The warmer temperatures and extra carbon dioxide lead to a longer growing season and lead to more pollen being produced, thus creating a longer allergy season. Spring has officially sprung, and while we may not see as many impacts here in the Coachella Valley, many of our part-time residents may see an extra dusting of yellow when heading back home. Live in studio, Spencer Blum, News Channel 3. Okay, thanks Spencer.